TV musings for a new spring TV show, Resurrection. Hey everyone, it is Shannon. I'm here to do a TV review, episode review, season premiere review for Resurrection. I know Nor I like having like this little stand with something on it, but um, I'm trying a different camera, so it's different framing, and this is what was working. Hopefully it works. I don't know if it'll be annoying. Um, I haven't done a TV review for a while, so but Resurrection has been kind of on my mind since I watched it a couple days ago, and and uh, I thought I'd do a review. Why not? Um, now, if you're unfamiliar with the show, it's based on the book called The Return by Jason Mott, and the series premise is about a small town and in called Acadia, Arcadia, and people from it who have passed away begin to come back alive. Um, so that's, and it's weird because it's apparently not connected to the French series Les Reverends, um, even though they have a very, very similar uh, premise. And um, I just, it's, so, it's just so weird. Anyway, whatever. Apparently they don't. So just it's so striking but anyway moving on so I don't know if I need a spoiler warning here or not I've only seen the first episode and I only really know the premise and most of the things I'm just sort of coming up with on the fly I did start to read the book I read enough of the book that what sort of happened in part of this first episode so I don't know more than what you see in that episode um so with this premise the there are things that I definitely liked about the uh, the the show um Omar Epps is in it he's sort of like the outsider he's kind of like the Audrey if you will if you're a Haven fan um, he, you know, he brings a returned boy back um, to the town, and and I really like him. I've I've always been a fan of Omar Epson, so I'm really happy to see him, and he does a good job here. So that's cool. I like the idea of this town, like the whole idea that it's a small town that bor that has borders, many borders, and uh, either physical or otherwise, and so outsiders are think they know what's best for the town when in fact you know, they, they're very suspicious and, you know, they're like, you know, we're our own entity kind of thing. That's an interesting premise for me. It's a different take on a small town. I, you know, I've always lived in a big city, so I don't really, I don't really, it's it's nice, it's, it's interesting to see a different view and one that feels um, like I understand that. I understand what that would be like and it's relatable in a weird way. So those are both cool things. Um, and so far, the story feels pretty interesting. The acting is good. The ideas are interesting. Um, I, I thought, I actually originally thought it was about people that disappeared, but it actually apparently looks like people who have died. Um, so, and so far we've, we've seen one person come back and two people actually died, but one person come back came back. So that's really weird. It makes things very complicated. There's definitely lots of interesting questions in relationships and emotional, you know, depths that can be, you know, explored here without question. I think that's going to be the heart of the show. And I think it really has something there. There's a lot of questions to be asked. I do have concerns, of course, with the title and with actually, and also with the title change. The book is called The Returned and the series is called Resurrection. And my big concern of this is that it will be very religious. So far, it's hard to say. There is a pastor character. He's definitely one of the main characters of the town. And you know, if it ends up skewing very religiously, you know, the title Resurrection, <laughs> you know, it's not, you know, it's very different than Returned. So if it goes religious way, I'm probably off, you know, uh, not, I'm probably not going to watch it. Um, so, but there is sort of questioning, the pastor definitely questions, you know, what is and what is not, and, you know, it could be a crisis of faith kind of thing, that which, you know, may or may not be interesting. But for me, the acting was good, the concept is interesting, the emotional responses are good, and they are complicated, and I like that, and they're not necessarily the same for all the different people involved. There's also the whole idea of, do you believe or not believe that this is even actually happening, that this is the person, because the one thing, oh, I might have just skipped over this, I did skip over this, one thing is this what we have in this first episode of someone who died 30 years ago and they come back but they're the same age as when they left so there's a young boy and he comes back and his parents are basically grandparent age 
but he's still a young boy, you know, and so that can create really can, different uh, family dynamics, you know, depending on whether the age gap is increased or in in a way decreased, because if someone who's older leaves and comes back, you now the people that they know have grown up, you know, and that's a different dynamic. Someone who is your best friend can now be your parents' age. And if, will they have lots of people that come back and will the age or the time period be the same or different, you know, how does that, and how will the, if there are more than one returned, how will they interact with each other? Will they have some, some different kind of relationships, some shared memories, those kinds of things. So there's lots of interesting places it can go, but if it goes skews really religious, then, you know, it's not, it's not the show for me. But so far, I found it interesting. I think I'll skip with, I'll stick with it. Um, and, you know, see how it goes. So that's my thought on Resurrection so far. Let me know if you're watching, um, if you're interested in watching, if you have watched, what you thought of the first episode, um, if you've read the book. Um, I'd be curious to hear about that as well. It airs on City TV, I think on Sundays. Is it Sundays? Or Mondays? Man, TV is busy times. And for me, this is one that, I, like, I I I don't I I don't know it's the for me it's the emotional connection and questions that are keeping me with it a little bit more than the concept which is very not what I expected I really thought it would be I'd be really curious about the mystery uh, what happened how did it happen does it mean something does it mean something greater for the world you know for whatever but I'm just really curious in how, in the people stuff which surprises me but I am so there we go I'll stick with it for now that is resurrection. <laughs> I don't know if I'll stick with the taping thing. <laughs>